If you're looking for Facebook cover dimensions, don't worry, I've got you covered. So in essence, we're going to create a document that looks something like this. So with a Facebook cover photo, when viewed on a desktop, it will crop to 820 by 312. And then when viewed on mobile, it will crop to 640 by 360. So in essence, what we want to create is a document that's 820 by 360. And then we're going to assign a safe area of 640 by 312 where you can put all your key information. That way, whether it's viewed on desktop or mobile, the key information will always be visible. So let's get started by going to File, New. So we're going to set a web document. So make sure resolution is 72 and the color mode is RGB. And we're going to set a width of 820 and we're going to set a height of 360. And we don't need to have any artboards, so you can turn your artboards off. Once ready, press create. So with the new file created, we're just going to quickly command zoom in here. Come over to my shape tool, select the rectangle, click on the canvas, and I'm going to set a width of 640 and a height of 312. And the color doesn't matter, but make sure you've got a fill color selected and the stroke turned off. Press OK. Use the selection tool, hold Command or Control on the background, and then simply center your safe area from there. Select the rectangle, make sure your rulers are on by going to View Rulers, and then you can drag out guides to use for reference. From there, you can delete or switch off this rectangle, and now you have your reference. So this is your desktop, this is your mobile, and this is your safe area to keep all your key information. Before you start designing, remember to save the Photoshop file. So file, save. I'm gonna save this to my computer. I'm gonna save it to my images folder. I'm just gonna call this sample. Press save, and now you can go ahead and design your Facebook cover. Once you're ready to export the cover to be uploaded to Facebook, remember the file size needs to be lower than 100 kilobytes. So we're gonna go to file, export, export as. Select the two up so that you can see the file size here. And Facebook recommends a PNG, but you can use JPEG, you can use PNG. Just make sure that file size is under 100 kilobytes. So if you select PNG, we've got a file size of 14 kilobytes, so that's absolutely fine. Don't need transparency, happy with the width and the height. And then finally then when you're ready, you can simply click export. Select where you'd like to save it, so I'll save it to the images, give it a name, so Facebook cover photo, and then finally click save. And there you go. It's that simple to create and export a Facebook cover photo that will upload to Facebook and can be viewed on both desktop and mobile, so long as you put your key information in this safe area here. So I hope you found this tutorial helpful, and if you did, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching, keep on designing, and I will see you for the next tutorial.